Hare Krishna. So many techniques we have discussed about chanting in these Japa motivation videos. And as I always say, the technique is just an endeavor from our side. But finally, techniques are not the ones you know, which uh, helps our quality chanting, but it's the mercy of the Lord. But yes, when we endeavor by employing various techniques, we prove to the Lord that, yes, oh Lord, I want your mercy. And yes, by the mercy of the Lord, our chanting becomes quality. So one of the things that devotees do is, they keep the photo of their spiritual master. And looking at the photo of the spiritual master, begging and praying to him, they chant their rounds. Now this meditation is very nice that I'm sitting at the lotus feet of my spiritual master and I'm chanting my rounds of Hare Krishna Mahamantra. Now just, just have this meditation, just have this contemplation that you're sitting at the lotus feet of your spiritual master. So if you are initiated, you now your spiritual master and Srila Prabhupada, if you're not initiated, then yes, you have Srila Prabhupada. So now, just imagine that you're sitting at the lotus feet of the spiritual master and you're chanting. And the spiritual master is looking at you. Now tell me, will we get any other thought of this world? Spiritual master is penetrating. With his penetrating glance, he's looking at us. Shula Prabhupada is looking at us. Tell me, how will the mind get distracted? So in this way, we can always have this meditation. You know, keeping uh, the Patachitra, the photo of the spiritual master. Or having it in the meditation while chanting the Pranam Mantra of the spiritual master or Shla Prabhupada. That yes, I'm sitting at the lotus feet and I'm chanting and they're looking at me. They're observing me what I'm doing. And it's very natural when we have been observed by someone, we become very attentive. And we should beg and pray. Now when we're sitting at the lotus feet of the spiritual master, meditating on his lotus feet, we should beg and pray to him that please help me to chant attentively. Therefore, this one thing you now really helps a lot because the devotee is taking shelter of the spiritual master while chanting the Hare Krishna Mahamantra. So today when we are chanting, we can keep the Patachitra, the photo of the spiritual master in front or we can have it in the meditation that yes, now I am sitting at the lotus feet of my spiritual master and he is observing me and for his pleasure, let me chant properly, let me chant attentively. And every round we should remind ourselves. Anyways, first thing that we do while chanting is we chant the Pranam Mantra of the Spiritual Master, Shula Prabhupada, Panch Sattva Mantra and then we start our chanting of Hare Krishna Mahamantra. So every time when we chant the Pranam Mantra of Spiritual Master or Shula Prabhupada, we should remind ourselves that yes, they are observing me. For their pleasure, I should chant properly. So this meditation, Let's chant our rounds. Every single round, let's meditate on this aspect of the spiritual master observing us and we sitting at the lotus feet and chant our rounds attentively for their pleasure. Hare Krishna.